Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing Halloween look number three, I believe. And for this look, it's going to be Sally from Nightmare Before Christmas, which is Jack Skellington's girlfriend. Um, if you want to know how I did this look, keep on watching. Context, I went in with ivory and the link is going to be in the description down below. I did moisturize my face already. I used the e.l.f. moisturizer. Okay, so I'm going to be going in with my hydrating primer. Okay, so now that our face is moisturized and primed, I'm going to be going in with a flat foundation brush and I'm just wetting it to activate the paint and I'm going in with this paint palette and using this um, baby blue. Okay, so I'm going to be using this smaller flat brush because the other one was too big. Um, this one fits fine. I'm just going in with the sponge just to kind of blend the streaks. This is just the sponges that come like on the Halloween makeup kits. Um, you could also use a beauty blender. For my brows, I'm actually going to be going in with the orangish color that I did on my last video, which is the same with the paint palette. And I'm going to be going in with this eyebrow brush by Cara Beauty. Okay, so I'm going to go in with the orange just to put the base on it. And then I'm going to be going in with the red. concealer I'm gonna be going in with this morphe flat brush this is just like a concealer brush I think I'm gonna be going in with the white all my brushes I'm wetting them first just because this is water activated paint so it's gonna it needs water to activate first just like white with a little bit of the blue I'm just gonna highlight now that we have our concealer wherever we want it I'm gonna be going in with my beauty blender and blending. So I was struggling a little bit just because my beauty blender um, was a little bit too wet from the tip. 
so it was actually like washing off the paint in certain parts um so yeah i went in with the the opposite side which was more dry so be careful with that guys to set my face i'm gonna be going in with the nyx hd um finishing powder i'm just gonna be going in with the morphe e54 brush Okay, my camera turned off, um, but I set my face with translucent powder and I also set my eyebrows with the pink makeup box palette and I went in with this orangish reddish um, eyeshadow. So I think I'm going to do R11, which is a contour brush. And going with the same palette, the pink makeup box eyeshadow palette. And I think I'm going to try this medium blue. Tap the excess. contour the nose so I'm actually going to be going in with this darker blue and this contour um, brush and contour my forehead Contour my face. Okay, so I'm going to be doing my eyes now. Okay, so I'm going to be using this bend blending brush. And I'm going to be going in with the same palette. And with this middle shade first. Grabbing this flat brush, I'm going in with this darker blue, which is the one we use to contour. And I'm focusing and I'm just focusing on put tapping it in on the eyelid part going back with the blending brush I'm just gonna blend it out a little bit I'm going in with the NYX jumbo eyeliner in white and going on my under okay so now going in with the morphe m 456 brush we're going in with both blues that we use as eyeshadows and just doing the bottom line
Whoa. Lashes, I'm gonna be going in with Heaven. And I will be right back. Okay, so this is what the lashes look like. Okay. So for the lips, I'm gonna be going in with a light light glam you the palm. Next, I'm going to be going in with this brush. And I'm going to go in with the black. With this pencil brush, I'm just blending. Very lightly. Highlight, I'm going in with the Platinum Eyes Jeffree Star Highlighting Palette and I'll be using Glacier and I'll be using this brush. To set my face, I'm going in with the Too Faced Hangover. Yes, I totally forgot she has another scar like over here. I was looking at a doll picture and obviously that one doesn't have it. Um, but yeah, like the, the cartoon has, she has a scar like across her face. So, I'm going in again with the black and I'm just putting it here just so that we could start small. You see how in some pictures like this one she has a scar and in others she doesn't. So. Ugh. I don't know if it's a one full scar or like two different ones, but whatever. Okay, so now we're done. So this is the final look. So I got this cute little dress at Hot Topic. I believe it was around 20 bucks. This wig I got it off of Wish uh, a while ago. I think it was $12 and then I just spray painted with the cans. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click on the little bell after you subscribe, just so you can get notified for when I post videos. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is going to be my Halloween costume for this year for my baby shower. So I'm pretty excited. Okay, see you guys next time. Bye.